Hey guys, uh, back with another video. Today we have a bit of a mystery box jumble, madness, whatever you want to call it. We have three mystery boxes from various people. So, before we get into it, uh, you know what to do. Hit that like button below, subscribe to the channel, and leave your comments. Do you like these mystery boxes? Do you like mystery boxes in general? What are your thoughts overall? I tend to stick to the uh, guaranteed value mystery boxes, unless it's like, you know, $15, like, because that's the price of a pop, basically. So, whatever I get, I get. So, uh, I will start opening them. All right, so first up, we have uh, this Funko box. I believe this is from uh, the Funko Queen on Instagram. So I will open this up and let's see what we got. It just... Right. Let me just pull this out. Ooh, it's a Funko Shop exclusive. Oh, oh this is cool. Captain Cupcake. So, funny story, I just ordered this one on the Funko shop, but it's cool, I like the ad icon, so I think, unless they have two of them, I don't know, but uh, yeah, so this is cool. Oh no, wait, I think I ordered the Ding Dong. So, I think they're different. I don't know, we'll see. But either way, it's cool. I like the ad icons, like I said. And yeah, so she was, um, she recently moved and she was going through her collection and sort of downsizing and was offering mystery boxes. So I bought one. 
Let me uh, open up the new one, the next one. All right. So the next one we got is from Captain Pops. So he was on one of his live streams, maybe? I forget where he was. Maybe it was just on Instagram. He was offering some mystery boxes and I think they were like uh, 12 bucks each. So I got two. So I don't want to see that. Uh, Oh, this is cool. So, I guess because it's a mystery box, he wrapped it up. He bubble wrapped it and then he wrapped it up in uh, brown paper. So that's cool. So, uh, this is number two. We yeah, have one other number right there. Oh, ooh, Thor. Okay, I actually wanted this one. I didn't have it in the collection yet. I have the Bro Thor, but I didn't have Thor. Looks like he came out of his box a little, but I'll be, you know, I open these to show you guys, and then I put them back in, so it doesn't really matter. To just put it back in a box. But uh, yeah, so that's cool. You know. And then the other one is Number 12, yes. Number 12. Overwatch. Okay. Ooh. The uh, E Triple C exclusive from last year, Sombra. That's cool. So, actually, before we open the Spat Stick collectibles, let me do a quick uh, where's my phone? Oh, here's my phone. Let me do a quick check on prices. Like I said, I paid pretty much what I would in retail for all these boxes. So, you know, Ooh, this one's 15. It was actually so it was a shared exclusive to Amazon. So you could only get that one on Amazon. So he got really lucky that, because I've heard not a lot of people are super lucky on Amazon. So then we got, uh, 
the Thor, I don't think that six dollars. Yeah, it's. I just like. I just think it's cool. I like all the Avengers Endgame, um, pops, and like I said, I was gonna buy it anyway. So. And then, uh, this one's 13. So, like I said, all common pops, they're not, you know, they save their, uh, big ones for, you know, bigger mystery boxes. They're not, but it's still cool. You know, I don't really collect the Overwatch ones. I mean, the gaming ones, I've never played the game. You know, it, so that'll be up for trade or sale sale or something and yeah so uh let's check out the uh spastic box so this box was part of the uh, mega grail i think it was called the mega box and it included, it was $60, and it included three plus pops. So there are at least three pops in here. And there were a bunch of pops that I liked on the picture. I forget which ones. But, and it was guaranteed $60, so uh, I wasn't, okay, good. So I opened it down. Oh, no, wait. I can't, uh, I don't know. Let me, okay, I'll, I'll do it this way. All right, so, so there are four pops in here. Ooh, one of them's one of them's in a protector, so a soft protector. So let's uh, open them up. I'll save the one in the protector for less. Okay. Ooh, kingpin. Okay, so I actually this was one of the first pops I picked up. I saw it at a local collectible, collectible shop, and I saw it had the specialty series sticker on it, and I really liked the Marvel 80 Years line. But, uh, yeah, so I already have this, so it'll be on sale or maybe it'll just be an out of box pop because it is cool so i don't know we'll see but uh so let me turn this around because the, the protectors on that side uh. all right so Not, uh, I don't know how to do it. Hold on. All right. So this one's Tsunade from Naruto. Naruto. Or I don't, I don't know how to pronounce it. But Tsunade. So that one's cool. I mean, like I've said, I'm not an anime person, but I do think the pops 
are some of the coolest in the line. So, yeah. And then here we have Trolls Branch. So again, I, you know, I think they have a chase of this too. And I picked up, I have the diamond one, the guy diamond troll, just because I thought it was cool. But not a, not a troll collector. Ooh, awesome. Hollywood Freddy. Wow. So this is my first, well, I have a couple of the vinyl Freddies, but this is the first uh, Funko Freddy, Funko Pop Freddy. So that's cool. I think, I don't think it's worth a ton. There's some that are worth like a thousand dollars. This isn't one of those, but I think this is worth something. So let's check it out. Let's see what they're worth. Come on, app, stupid app. Ooh, it's 420. You know what that means. Okay, so the branch is $11. The chase is actually 24, so that would have been cool. Kingpin's $14. So twenty five. Tsunade is ten bucks. So thirty five. And drum roll. Uh, that was a bad drum roll. 32 bucks. So not super expensive, but so all in all for the four pops, uh, 67 bucks. And I forgot what the shipping was. I don't know. But, and of course, so the, uh, I got this Fasted Collectibles sticker again, which is cool because the other one was kind of bent and ruined. So, but, uh, So that's it. Uh, I will quickly unbox these and show them to you. So uh, hold on. All right. So I couldn't open all the, well, yeah, I couldn't open all the boxes. The Thor, there was some, uh, he's like hog tied or something in there so 
I couldn't, I mean, I didn't want to cut it and, I don't know. But, I mean, there's not much, there's, there's nothing hidden. I put the head back in place. And, uh, yeah, so, you know, I put the head back in place and, you know, other than that, it's not much going on. It's just nothing hidden. So, didn't need to force it. I also couldn't open Freddy Funko because they have that tab thing on the, you know, I can't, I mean, I probably, I could eventually, but I felt, you know, just leave it and whatever. And I mean, again, there's not much that uh, you can't see from the box. So, but then we got, um, uh, Tsunade from Naruto. It's pretty cool. I mean, it's not as crazy as some of the other anime pops, but it's still pretty cool. She's in her fighting stance, getting ready to kick some butt. Then we have uh, Sombra from Overwatch. So that's cool. I, I really, oh, that's, she's got like stuff on her fingers, which is cool. Um, yeah, so I don't know. If anyone knows anything about Overwatch, let me know. Um, Then we have uh, Branch, the troll from World Trolls World Tour, which is it's cool. There, these are a lot. I mean, the regular trolls are kind of like just normal, like the old troll dolls. But those are kind of like because they're from the movie. So, then we have Kingpin with his cane and, yeah. So, that's cool. I mean, not like nothing else really, but, you know, there's some detail, the necklace and the, or the tie, I guess. I'm not sure what that's supposed to be. But and then uh, the cupcake, Captain Cupcake. So yeah, I did get I the one I had gotten was uh, the Ding Dong mascot. So I forgot what his name is. King Ding Dong, maybe. Because he has the crown on his head. But in the package, they kind of look the same. But, uh, yeah, so he's got his captain hat on, his captain uniform on. So, yeah, it's kind of cool. Like I said, I like all the ad icons. They're kind of cool and nostalgic. And I mean, even the ones. Like the tuna guy, I don't eat tuna fish from a can anyway. I'll eat 
a tuna, but not tuna fish. Uh, but yeah, so that's it. I will link the uh, these guys below. Now, Captain Pops is on. He has a YouTube channel. If you're not, he's uh, he has some good stuff out. He just did a coronavirus episode where he's wearing like plastic bags all over. So that was pretty funny. And then um, Funko Queen, uh, she has a YouTube channel, but she hasn't posted anything in a few months. I know, like I said before, she was moving, so I'm not sure if once she gets settled in, if she'll start doing that again. But she's also on Instagram, so I'll link that below, and you could check her out. And Spastic Collectibles, uh, you know, I'm pretty happy with them. They're they give you guaranteed value, so you get what you're guaranteed to get what you spend. You know, I've seen some videos that people post where they get a few dollars less because, you know, the prices fluctuate all the time. So, you know, maybe... I don't know. If you're if you're just in it for the value, then you know, I don't know. I don't know what to tell you. But you could get some cool stuff in there. And you know, you, you get even the ones you don't like, you get stuff that you could trade or to someone who does like them because there are a lot of people who like trolls and there are a lot of people who like anime and overwatch. So, you know, I'll be doing something with them. So, uh, so I figured out this is going to be the, uh, mystery box coronavirus edition. That's what this one's going to be. So, uh, yeah. If you liked what you saw, hit that like button below, subscribe to the channel, and uh, leave your comments. Also, hit that uh, notification bell thing. So, when I drop a new video, you'll know about it. You know, I drop, I try and drop every day, at least for now. I have a bunch of videos waiting, but once that goes away, I don't know, you know, I just, I wanted to do like a video every, almost every day to start the channel because I figured you know, keep people coming back. But once, I, I don't know. We'll see. But uh, so go check out the unusefulidiots.com for all things that I do. And that's it. Yeah, that's it. So see you guys.